Welcome to the PC Tips Pro and in today's video we are going to see how to add slider as header to Google Sites. So before getting into the video, if you guys haven't yet subscribed to the PC Tips Pro, please do subscribe. And now let's get into the video. So here we are with our page. So if you want to learn more about the Google Sites, you can just go visit the play playlist on the Google Sites. So if you want it, I'll just ping it on the description so you can just go check it out. So then now let's see the topic. So we want our header to be a carousel. So it's something like a slider. So how we can do that? So basically it only accepts the image format only. So how we can do that? So for for doing it, you just need to first uh, get rid of this header section that we are having, delete it. So now we are not having any header. So in this part, we want to insert, uh, okay, we'll go to the insert and then scroll down. Here you can see this option of image carousel. Click on it and here you can insert images. So click on this add image and click on upload image. So let's say that I want to add these three images. So I can just choose them and um, click on open. So here I got these three uh, images. Click on insert. And here we got this. So what we need to do is we just need to position it something like our uh, header. So how our header is positioned. You just need to position it in that particular way. So let me just make the changes this way. So yes. It just takes some few adjustments to make it in that. So here I have adjusted it. So here we need to now go to the settings part. And here in the settings we need to click on the auto start. And also the transition speed also we can choose. So let's say I give it to be fast. And update it. So to check how it is getting up getting looked at your website once you publish it you can just check this preview part all the time so before publishing you can just check it like how it is looking on the mobile devices on the pc so here you can see our slider so it is moving very fast so we can even make the changes to this by just going here and clicking on the settings part and here so i can just change the transition speed to be medium and update it again and let's see the preview again. So here you see that it auto starts and it moves. So you can even use this buttons to move to the left or right part if you want. So this is how it looks on a, a tablet. This is how it looks on a large screen and this is how it looks on a mobile phone. So in this way you can just check for this uh, uh, how it is looking on different devices by using this preview option. So in this way, you can replace your header with a slider for your Google website on Google Sites. So this is all for this video, guys. I hope you found this video useful to you. And don't forget to subscribe to PC Tips Pro. Thank you for watching, guys.